I probably should have said this first, and I'll probably put this at the beginning, but I'm confused on why jobs literally, like, especially a warehouse job, they think that I need this job. <laughs> why do you think that I need this job? You, first of all, the only reason why I'm here is because y'all pay for my music school, number one. Number two, y'all have tuition, so that means y'all give reimbursement money. Number three, y'all are paying money every week, every week, and it's constant overtime. Number four, I'm working this job because I wanted to stack money and get out of debt quicker. Y'all helped me with that. But for you to be telling me as if I need you for money, it's crazy. I don't need this job. You need us. You need workers. And because certain people are going to take the money that you're offering because they're going to take the devaluation of themselves, they're going to take that. And then you get someone like me. That's going to be like, nah, I ain't doing no extra work for no extra money. For the same money you giving me. More work, extra money. More work and the same money, no work. Simple. It's simple math. Goofball. Don't ever think that I need this, this job because I don't. I don't know what be wrong with some of these jobs out here. They be thinking that, you know lean on me or something like no it's plenty of jobs out here i'll go find something else yeah y'all crazy as hell thinking that boy crazy as hell i don't, I don't know why y'all thinking like that that's pretty much how my job is acting as if i need them what's good y'all my name is Monty, and welcome back to the channel if you're returning What's good with my 3P family? Dab me up. How y'all feeling? I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Today is Sunday. It's my day off. And I was gonna go in today. I don't think I am. It was overtime. They sent out a little group chat, whatever, whatever. Here's my point. F this 9 to 5, honestly. that That's where I'm at. That, that... That's where I'm at with it. F the nine to five, especially a warehouse. I can't really say what I want to say, but since this is my channel, I'm going to say what I want to say. Um, before we get into this video, one thing I have to get out the way. My videos are not me complaining. It's me telling you how life is, <laughs> basically. And if you take it as complaining, then that's on you. I don't care no more. Um, you can eat one. How about that? Uh, number two, uh, to the coworker, whoever sent my channel or YouTube channel, maybe my, my video was found by one of the bosses. Your mom's a hoe. Um, whoever sent my channel to, to basically, I don't know if they sent it to corporate or sent it to my boss or whatever. Your mom's a hoe, okay? That's one. Uh, that's just that on that. I'm going to have to discuss on that later because I'm about to have a sit down with my job because of it. So thanks. Appreciate you because you're trying to knock me off my grind. I appreciate you. Appreciate that. But whatever you're trying to do, you're not going to succeed. Let's jump into this. A nine to five, I, I'm realizing it just ain't for me. I'm thinking about just becoming an entrepreneur, <laughs> honestly, because I know I got the drive for it. I know I got the mindset for it. I really want to just say screw these nine to fives and just become my own boss. Reason being, when you're your own boss, who the hell is going to fire you? Casper? Who the hell going to fire me besides me? I'm my own boss. I'm 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 the head honcho of everything. <laughs> You dig me? That's that's where I'm at with it. And sooner or later, entrepreneurship is going to be the way for a lot of people. 
I'm, it's clicking for me. I, I realize a nine to five just ain't for me. Now, don't get me wrong. A nine to five to me is a trap. All nine to fives is a trap. Reason being, these nine to fives are designed to keep you comfortable with what you're doing. There's two different people in this world. People that are going to settle for less and people that understand that they're more valuable. <laughs> I'm one of those. Um, you're going to settle for less for jobs because, you know, they're paying you. You need money, whatever, whatever. And then they get people like me where I'm at the job and then they think they're going to throw more work on me. Screw you. I, screw you. I'm not doing nothing. No, I'm going to do my job. And if they're incapable of doing theirs, then that's on them. Screw it. I'm not doing more than what you're asking me for. You're going to give me a pay raise. We can't do that. Then screw off. Simple as that. And I'm at the point. If you want to hire somebody for, as my replacement, go ahead. Go ahead. Do what y'all got to do, because I'm fed up with it. I'm fed up with the nine to five. Honestly. You're trading your time for money. Bosses don't trade their time for money. I see bosses that take flights places. They taking trips because they got a business. They're owning. They're owners. No, I'm tired of being a worker and it's going to stop today. <laughs> I'm over it. I'm done. OK. I'm tired of. You know, having to go to a nine to five and then you building up time off, you know, sick time, all this bull crap. You just trading off. We're not doing that. Nah, nah. Becoming an entrepreneur is going to be my way. And I don't, I don't care what y'all say, because if you think about it, YouTube is entrepreneurship. I'm already doing it. Hello. When you're a YouTuber and content creator, you're your own boss. You do what you want. OK, that's one. Becoming an entrepreneur is going to be my wave that I think that's going to be the plan. I and I know I'm a hustler. I, I know I am. I can make money different kinds of ways. I'm already doing it. As an entrepreneur, I'm a producer. I'm selling beats on YouTube that I do have a separate YouTube that's monetized as well. Just got monetized three weeks ago. OK, that's two channels. I also have a gaming channel that I'm going to start locking in once 2K25 drops. I'm going to lock in on that. Close to getting monetized over there. That's another channel down. Thank you, God, because everything I've been asking for is happening for me. I appreciate you. You know how how long I've been staying down. I've been patient, very, very patient. Now, don't get me wrong. A nine to five has its place and provides stability. It does. Do not get me wrong. Do not get me wrong. It has benefits. Uh, a predictable schedule, you know, hopefully, you know, that can fit with you. If you got kids, it all of these things factor in. Um, but at the end of the day, these companies are in them are, are, are in it for themselves. They could care less about you, bro. They they could care less about you, literally. Like, I'm so not ready to have this sit down for this for this stupid whoever did that just did it out of pure hate. Because you see someone succeeding and you're hating. But it's cool because all of that energy that you got that you think is gonna happen and you think it's gonna go your way, it's not. I promise you it's not. I promise you it's not. But. <laughs> let's talk about entrepreneurship. Let's talk about it. Why do I want to go into entrepreneurship? One, I already know a little bit about the stock market. Who said that I cannot learn how to trade stocks? Yo, I, I'm so my work ethic is is through the roof, through the roof. I hate being outworked. I hate it, which is why I grind so hard now. Just take take this for an example. Entre I'm in entrepreneurship right now, I guess you could say as a YouTuber. How many videos am I dropping a day? I'm dropping every day. I've been dropping for 30 days straight. It's going on 50 next week. It'll be 50. 
in two weeks, actually. As far as videos and content go, I've dropped o over 30 plus videos, over. I know I can grow beyond this nine to five. I wanna, I wanna trade stocks. Just because I already know a little bit of information on it and I know it's just gonna take a little more studying, but I know I can change my life. I know I can. I know I can replace this nine to five by doing entrepreneurship. I, I know I can. See, the thing is nine to fives, especially at warehouses, you have no freedom. Your, your time is constantly tied into this dumb ass warehouse job. This job is dumb. All, all, all warehouse job, a warehouse job is so toxic that I don't even talk to nobody. I stay to myself. Number two, in a warehouse, people are so, it's just full with drama, drama all the time. People are always talk about each other all day, every day, especially the dudes. Dudes act more like females than they act like dudes. It, it's confusing. That's why I stay away from y'all. Y'all, something we don't know about. But nonetheless, I stay away from y'all. I stay away from everybody at work. And I stay to myself because y'all are weird. No, I'm not an introvert. I just read people, and when I read the room and scan the environment, oh, yeah, I'm cool off, y'all. Y'all got it. So I'm off. Demons, I'm good. I want freedom. I'm already close to financial freedom. That's one. But I want freedom to be able to do and go as I please, not have to answer to nobody, Becoming my own boss. And it's starting today. It's starting today. This this warehouse job, they got it. They got it. If if I go into this meeting and have a sit down with them and they try to let me go because of my channel. I'm going to be pissed. Number one. But number two. That be, being mad ain't going to last too long. Let me, I'm going to tell y'all that. It ain't going to last long. It ain't going to last long because that might be a blessing in disguise, especially because I'm already feeling in my heart that I already want to leave in the first place. It, it's not going to go the way y'all want it. I promise. It's, it's not. Now, look, yeah, it's risky becoming an entrepreneur. I get it. It's hard, but isn't worth waking up Every day, knowing that you're building something good and it's yours, entrepreneurship isn't just a career, y'all. Like, it's not just a career, it's a choice, it's a lifestyle, and it's a mindset. And I'm beginning to realize that some of you can't relate to me because. You know, you just not at the same mindset as me. And that's OK. But don't try to knock me off what I'm doing. Because everything I told y'all I said I was going to do a month ago is happening. 30 days, I, I changed my life. In 30 days. 30 days. Now, what's going to come with this, you know, entrepreneurship? It's going to come challenges. I know this already. I know this already. Okay. Um, so let's not sugarcoat it pretty much. Let's not sugarcoat it. Entrepreneurship isn't easy. It's a grind. But I'm already doing it. I'm working two jobs, three jobs, if you count my studio one, which I don't even count no more because I haven't really been getting booked all like that. Um, so two, I still count it because I do get booked here and there, but the the dream would be me working as an audio engineer and doing YouTube full time. That's the goal. 
That's my end goal. Having my dream jobs, working and traveling, and being an entrepreneur, making money from all different angles. That is my end goal. Now, why am I choosing entrepreneurship? Why should I choose entrepreneurship? Why should you? Why am I? Because nine to fives, I'm understanding ain't for me. Like I said, it's it's not. This this whole clocking in, uh, staying over, doing twelve hour shifts, doing ten hours there, no time to go on vacation, no time to go do anything. Constantly working around the clock for a month for money. Nah, that's not a life. And then for you to retire from working 20 years at this same place. And then what? Nah. Nah. Warehouse ain't it and I'm not doing it.